Greetings, my burrito humanoids. Today, we're going to look at my first Minecraft world. Not my, not my first world, but my first long build uh, city. I don't know. But this is where it all started. This is my house. And uh, when I lived here, um, I had a, a roommate named Steve. I realized that there was only one bed, so maybe it was a little, a little homo, but uh, that's okay. No judgment. But yeah, this was my house, and uh, I, I had plans to, you know, have some storage or whatever. Here's my incinerator. Um, but uh, yeah, I didn't really do much in here. So yeah, this was it. This was where it all started. Um, of course, I had to have my wraparound porch so I can spy on monsters. And plenty of torches lit up. I have the monsters turned off now. I'm in peaceful mode. It's all peaceful now. But uh, back when I first started, I had monsters. So if we go down here, we'll find the house of the other creator of this world, and that was Jamie. And this is her house down this way. I think I had a sign somewhere. Let's see, let's go to her house. Down this little secret passage. Oh, what's in there? Oh, cave formation. And then right into a bedroom, hell yeah. <laughs> All right, this is Jamie's house. And I'm pretty sure she built all of it by herself, except for maybe the roof. I seem to recall helping with that dormer window. Yeah. Do a little flyby over that. She was always real good at doing gardens. I was always impatient with garden areas. I'm just like, ugh. I just want to build structures. But, uh... She took the time to decorate. A little fire pit area. Isn't that nice? And then I built this path. Wait a minute. Where does this go? I have no idea. Oh, okay. That goes around there. Um, but yeah, I built this path up here to our hot air balloon. A little bit of a sketchy path, but uh, yeah, look at this. So we, we have a um, modifier in this world, so fire doesn't spread. Otherwise, this would light up like it did the first time I lit it up. It just completely all burned after I built it. But luckily, I remembered how I built it. And uh, yeah, so that's the hot air balloon. Oh yeah, and of course the bridge. Now I remember when I built this bridge... Uh, Jamie was working on her house in here and then I was like I finished the bridge and she comes out and she's like oh my god it is way too huge <laughs> but I was like how else would you span a gap like that you'd have to have a pretty beefy bridge so that was my my reasoning for the big bridge um oh yeah I forgot there's another part oh, is this where the sign is oh uh, yes Jamie's that way and then farm and town. Okay, so this goes down the hill to my little farm area, which also has a mine shaft. Whee! Check out this mine shaft. It's all fancy looking. Yeah, I was like, is there a way to get back? All right, we're going back. Yeah! This is the fast way to look at the mine. There it is. That's it. That's the mine. <laughs> All right. And then here is the garden. You gotta have uh, vegetables. And then the critters. You got some pigs, and some sheep, and some cows. 
I wonder if uh, this texture pack is... Oh, yeah. Okay, here's the abomination. This texture pack is broken. Look, this is supposed to be a horse. What the fuck? It's got like an eye on its back. Is that like its face? I don't even know. It's got like a chest on it. What the hell? I should disable this. Because this is freaky. I, I built the... <clears throat> I built the world with Flow HD, but uh, it doesn't uh, doesn't work. It's broken. There's a, there's a good horsey. All right, so that is the little farm. So now, if you come down this way, I was very very secure. No zombies are getting in. Look at all the torches on the hill. Yeah, no monsters allowed. Uh, I'm pretty sure I disabled the monsters when, when Jamie joined. Uh, but this is a little little shopping area that Jamie made. We got here. We got the the Riverside Cafe. Doors open. Doors closed now. Got a little kitchen area. Very cozy. And then what we got here? Town of DJ Gift Shop. Where's all the gifts? <clears throat> yeah, so that's uh, Jamie's little... Little stores there. Early. Real early designs. Um, down this way... We got the Boathouse... Slash Fish Restaurant. Food by the river. <clears throat> and there's no food. Sad. But here's the boathouse. And there's boats. I'm kind of looking at this. I'm like, this is. Why is this so high up? I guess uh, so it doesn't get water in it. <laughs> <coughs> Excuse me. And then here is the Cozy Night Inn. And the office is open 24-7. Ring the bell for service, then pull the lever. Aha! There's a guy who could barely fit in here, but he, there he is. Give me service. He's just like, ha. Huh. Then pull the lever, and there he goes. Welcome. Enjoy your stay. All right. I wonder where they go. Honestly, I don't know. And I don't really want to break blocks to find out. But here's the little hotel. Let's go into room one. This is the first room. It's very cozy. If you like really cozy small hotels, this is the place. That's why it's called the Cozy Night Inn. Because you got to get cozy in there. And that was made by Jamie as well. <clears throat> All right. Now we go up here. This little little bridge here. I love making bridges. Bridges are cool. You don't really need bridge supports in Minecraft, but I like building them anyways. This was or this is the old town of DJ. And uh it used to be a just a normal spawned in village. Uh, there it is. That's the town. Um, but, you know, I remodeled it, made it look all nice with this brickwork and gravel pathing. And then this is the bungalows where all the villagers would live. Um, I think I built a bungalow for each house that was, was in the town originally so that they're all uniform construction. Ah! And then also, I built this arrow tower, or archery tower, I don't know what you'd call it, guard tower, because when I was playing on this world originally, I had the monsters activated, so I had to defend my village, and uh, I would shoot the monsters from up on this platform. And then sometimes they would shoot me, and I'd fall, and it was terrible. 
because it was really high up. <laughs> um, here we got the town square with the well. Nice deep well. Don't fall in there. And we got four square park. I love this park. It's literally like, well, it's, it's a little more than four squares, but there's a square here, a square here, a square here, and a pig. Pig. What an abomination. <laughs> Not as bad as that horse, though. Oh, there's a villager. Oh, we got, we got the corner mart. For some reason, I thought that it was the coroner's mart. <laughs> These kind of look like slabs, huh? Nothing in them. Nothing in these slabs. Oh, this is like a little back back door. Thirty paper for an emerald. Guess that's not a bad deal if you have paper. And then we got over here the best duds. And this is you got a little changing room here. Yeah. No clothes, though. Also, what's going on with this wall right here? What the what? Maybe this was supposed to be like a window display or something? I don't know. Didn't get finished. Or glitched out. The smithy. For when you need to furnace some things and repair anvil. All right, let's see. Okay, this is the mayor's mansion. This is the historical mayor's mansion built in 1901. Imagine that. We got a little living room, I think. Kitchen with water always in the sink. That's interesting. Oh yeah, here's a an oven design I dig, or like a stove top, putting these uh, these tracks on it. Kind of adds, adds something to it. And then the long table. Check out this this high chair design. Now with the Flow HD texture pack, the oak doors don't have windows. So that's probably what was going on. Why there's windows in the chair. Uh, let's see what's upstairs. Got a couple lofts. Big triple wide bed. Yeah. Nothing in there. Oh, got a big chandelier. That'll keep you up at night. The the torch chandelier. <laughs> Another triple wide bed over here. Yeah. I think there's a basement as well. Yep. Kind of a cool basement, honestly. I, I kind of dig it. It's got like some kind of laboratory in here or something. Basement laboratory. Lots of storage. Right in the bookshelves. Yeah, so that's the historical mayor's mansion. Um, and I know there's like a... Oh, I guess there's, there's a backyard in here, too. How do you get to it? Okay. Oh, look at that. There's a swimming pool. They built a swimming pool in 1901? Damn. With a diving board? That might have been a later edition, honestly. <laughs> Did I say 1801? I meant 19. I might have said 19. And then I thought I said 18, but I don't know. Don't matter. It was 1901. All right, so that is Town of DJ. Oh, here's another shop. The Book Nook. Well, I do believe they got some books. Yes, there are books in there. All right, if we come over here uh, to this little bridge here. Oh, I guess we're not going to cross the bridge yet because that was... We're just doing the early day stuff. I'm kind of going in order of, of when I built things. All right, here is the church of the town of DJ. And there's my bell tower. It's kind of a ghetto bell tower, but from, we'll see. From a distance, it looks like bells. And then I didn't really decorate it all in here. I put some pews, a little bap baptismal. Ugh, I can't even talk today. It's still, still early afternoon. Give me a break. <clears throat> Let's go out here, and this is the churchyard, aka the cemetery. And uh, you know, I got some empty graves because I didn't fill them. 
But over here, these are all the, the villagers that sadly passed away. We got Fred, who drowned. And Timmy, who also drowned. And Steve, here's where Steve was. He was, uh, he was my roommate, but uh, he disappeared one day. And so I made a grave for him. And Lurie, brother of Hurry. And Hurry, brother of Lurie, imagine that. Fred, not the only Fred in town. Graham, never paid by the ounce. Ah, ha, 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 ha. Kenny, yes, they killed Kenny. Of course they did. Will, died in his kingdom in Bel Air. Oh, that's a, a little reference for a house, a, l a later build. Sam, lost in the water. These guys were drowning. Jones, he's radioactive. Okay, this, there's a story behind that. Ugh, beat it? I don't remember that. Oh, and then, of course, Tom, my first friend. MySpace Tom. And then Mark, what a chump. <laughs> <clears throat> this is the, the catacombs mausoleum. I don't know what you call it. Got some, like, little closed-off area. That's where the royalty is. <clears throat> And then, what else we got in here? Forgot to add stairs. That's cool. Uh, oh, yeah, over here is where the mayor and his family are buried. This is uh, Tom Jr., Mayor Tom, Mayor Tom's wife, Linda. I think the Mayor Tom is kind of like a play on Major Tom, since we're avid David Bowie fans around here. Um, let's see. Oh, let's go back over there. Shoot, where am I going? Gotta get out of the churchyard. Oh, we could go this way. Oh my god, I hate these iron doors with the buttons. They're so difficult. Alright, this was a theme park. This was going to be a theme park. It is now a derelict, defunct theme park, but you can see the the DJ logo, David and Jamie, and this was the little entrance, it's a little overgrown, <laughs> but uh, it had potential, I was going to make uh, a bunch of roller coaster tracks, or like, you know, minecart tracks, switching back through here, actually there's a, a better balcony, better view down over this way yeah wouldn't that have been cool like mine carts just whipping through back and forth that would have been awesome but I never built it never finished it gave up game over oh look okay let's go over here and then probably wrap up this video wrap up this video with the Corbidors Mead Hall which, for some reason, I thought it'd be a, a cool idea to build a Viking-themed mead hall out of a Viking ship that was upside down. But it kind of just looks like a big poop. <laughs> Didn't really translate correctly, but here's like where you enter, and then you got the bar area, and then the... The benches that the Viking rowers would sit on are on the ceiling because the ship is upside down. <laughs> uh, but then there'd be like a little stage area for the band to play. It could be done better. I could I could do this better. I could make a Viking ship mead hall. But for now, that's it. That's all I'm going to show you in this video. Um, and then we'll explore other things in later videos. So, peace and chicken grease.